In this video, I will explain the default ports used by Nessus Professional when port scanning and how to configure a scan for a custom list of ports. Let's start by discussing the default ports used. The Tenable Community Knowledge Article 1319 shows the approximate number of default ports used and where you can find the full list of ports, which is in the Nessus Services file. I will now show the Nessus Services file from my scanner. You can see here that it lists each port used, as well as the protocol, one per line. Now that we know where to find the default ports, I'll demonstrate how to configure a scan for a custom list of ports. So let's go back to Nessus Professional and log in. From here, we will select New Scan in the top right corner. We will then choose the basic network scan policy, which is a comprehensive scan policy. We'll provide a name, an optional description, and then a list of scan targets in one of the format examples provided. We will next select Discovery on the left-hand navigation. Note the default value is common ports, and you'll see the list of configuration options that are provided with that. If we select this dropdown, we'll also see our other two options, which are all ports or custom. We will select custom. Note the three additional menu items on the left-hand navigation. Select port scanning, and we'll see that port scan range is set to the keyword default. We can change this to any list of comma-separated ports or port ranges. For my example today, I will use the reserve ports. I'll leave the rest of these settings at default. Now, I will click the Credentials tab to add a set of credentials that I need for this scan. For this example, I'll use a set of Windows credentials. We'll then click Save, which will bring us back to the main scans menu. If you scheduled your scan to run at a future time, it will run then automatically. If you wish to run it ad hoc, you may click the Launch button now. Additional configuration options can be found in our docs.tenable.com site in the Nessus User Guide.